Welcome everyone to another episode of the All Quarterback Fantasy Draft. And today's episode could be really, really rough because we're facing off against the Jacksonville Jaguars, who you can see have 99 overall Patrick Mahomes. And obviously we have a 13 overall defense. So trying to stop that, Patrick Mahomes with a 13 overall defense might be a little bit uh, hard. Uh, we may struggle just, 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 a, just a little bit. We've played decently well in the previous games. So there's at least a little bit of hope that we won't get absolutely crushed and just likely crushed. But if we can turn this into an all-out shootout, I think we'll be able to win it that way. So that's going to kind of be my aim for today's episode. All right, kick off to start things off. All right. No, 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 no. Yes. All right. That is two, the last two weeks we've had them return a kick for a touchdown to start the game, so try to avoid that. All right. How good are Mahomes' stats? Because that will really determine how good the rest of the team is. Okay, yeah. Um, this is going to be an interesting game. All right, they're starting off in shotgun. Not a shocker there. All right, I'll go on. I'll go on Anthony Richardson. All right, no, they have no other superstars or X factors in offense, aside obviously from Patrick Mahomes. All right, so they got Dawson Knox at tight end. See who else they have periodically throughout the game. Looks like Kenneth Walker at running back. I'm going right back to Knox. I mean, we're not going to be able to stop Mahomes, so. You just need to hope for a tipped pass or something. Alright, I get another first down. Show me the back number 16, who's a good receiver. I have no clue who that could be. So they got Rashad Bateman. KJ, is that KJ Hamler? Did they just not draft any good receivers? Or am I going crazy? Ooh, McSorley! Let's go! Ooh, we can't... Ah, we're not going to be able to house it. It's okay, though. Trace McSorley picking off Patrick Mahomes. I will take that any day of the week. A very rare interception, but things are going our way so far. I mean, shout out Trace McSorley. I mean, just read Mahomes like a book. Turned around at the right time and just snatched it out of the air. Oh, that's for uh, Tyler Lockett. See, so, yeah, they don't really have many great receivers. You know, they don't have a Malik Cunningham. They don't have a DTR. They don't have a Ryan Tannehill. So if you've not watched the last couple of games, basically offensively, figured out the only way we can have a good amount of success is running a no huddle offense. Just get out there and just throw the ball all over. There's no point in really trying to run it because it's just not going to work out well. So just airing it out seems to work best. All right, there's 20 yard, 21 yard pickup to Driscoll. We'll switch to Salem. Driscoll might be the guy again. He is. See, and that's why I have possession catch with him the last play. As good as he is, Driscoll is. He's still like a 50 overall. He's gonna drop some passes. All right, I like Millie Cunningham underneath. Just pick up a couple yards, or we can get sacked. I mean, no one was open, so nowhere for me to really go. I will try spot wide cross. Woof! Thankfully, Malik Cunningham drew that guy down so I could hit Driscoll behind. I will right, we'll go slot out, look Ritter out of the backfield. There we go, Ritter. There we go, Ritter! Oh, so close. So close. Let's just inside zone. Do we have an inside zone? We do. Halfback base. It's good enough. 
Come on, we need to get him his touchdown. He deserves it. All right, we're giving up. It's not going to happen. Give me, give me double slants. I'm looking at Ling. Shout out Danny Etling. There's another touchdown. I really wanted to get rid of that touchdown, but I guess we'll settle for Danny Etling. He's really stepped in in T Tannehill's absence. Good snag there. And kick the PAT. We were up 7 0. Did not think we would be up 7 0 at any point in this game. And the rough in the kicker, so I'll give us a guaranteed touchback. Ooh, actually, I don't even know if we'll be able to kick it far enough for a touchback. Ooh, this is tough. I don't know. If, I don't know if the kick can go that far. I don't know if it'll make it. I really should have just tried an onside. I really should have tried an onside because it's a 10-yard difference essentially. Ah, but then again, don't want to give Patrick Mahomes any uh, space. Alright, let's see if we can pick off another pass. Switch so a little bit of man coverage. They want to... They... Stop flipping the play, Mahomes. Oh! Ah, 12. That's Malik Willis. Couldn't get his... Couldn't switch on to him to catch that. Um, yeah, let's, let's go to cover three. I'm going to call it once, and we got a pick off of it, so. Good tackling, boys. Nice tackle there, Tyrod Taylor. Empty, I assume they're going to pass the ball. I don't think this is going to be a Patrick Mahomes run. All right, good find, good find. You know, th those plays are going to happen. It's just no denying it. I mean, they're in single back, but I still don't see how this is a run. Oh, I had that gap if he won it, but didn't have enough help otherwise. All right, that'll take us out of the first quarter and into the second. And we're up 7-0. to zero. I mean, they do have the ball. They're pretty close to scoring, but we scored first. And it's honestly a surprise. I'm going to go back on, ooh, Trace McSorley. Maybe the best user on this team. Okay, Trey Lance was held there, but I guess not. All right. Touchdown, Jaguars. I mean, you know, that's going to happen with this team. You just got to make, like, two cuts, two hard cuts, and our entire secondary is just beat. I mean, missed a the tackle there with Lance. Or no, it was Willis. Lance got caught up in the block. It's just a uh, bad play all around. Ooh, almost got the block a kick. We will also rough the kicker. I feel like this is going to be the most common penalty this year. Purely because of just how close it is to being able to block it. If you actually, like, go for the block and not the safe man. And I, I assume this is going to be a touchback. Yeah. All right, get, get back in the shotgun. Let Rodgers cook a little. Good job, Driscoll. Did just center Carson Wentz just got hurt. That's unfortunate. All right, let's put a little uh, bit of a backup package in, I guess. I'm just going to put Strevler on a slant here. All right, good job there by Strevler. Switch to an inside zone with Stetson Bennett. All 
Yeah. Not going to be able to run the ball with this team today. She's like... Why did Bryce Young and Struggler just switch there? And now they switch back. I just... I just don't understand. Putting Struggler back on a slant. Don't think the safety is going to bite down. Good, good throw by Anthony Brown to Driscoll. Really, really good throw. See, now, I don't get why it no huddles when we went... I get... Oh, I guess we didn't go out of bounds. All right, we're going to put Bryce Young on a slant. Oh, Bryce. Oh, Bryce. All right, once Bruce quad, he'll be back. All right, let's get Bryce Young back under center. Back in his natural position. And let's look to hit Sam Ellinger. I mean, there's pass interference, but I guess not. All right, third and ten. Let's get the starters back in there. We had our little bit of fun. Fun's over. I'm only looking the right side of the field, if I'm going to be honest. Ah, I should have possession caught that. I thought if I could have racked it and just outran the guys there. All right, let's go PA crossers. Tried and true. I'm going to put Danny Etling on a slant. Just because I'm not even going to look at him deep. All right, that was a very successful fourth down play. And that might have just cost us the game. Or did they just let Mahomes frantically scramble for five yards? What are we doing, guys? All right, good job there, Malik Willis. All right, third and three, they're going a little bit heavier. Gonna bring a safety blitz. Going all out. Oh, Trey Lance. Dude, you were, you had him. Easy fourth down, we get the ball back. And you just, one move and you are useless. It was perfect. Called the safety blitz. Timed it up right with the run. Jeez. So I want to try to get a little bit of pressure. Like, I would just, like, a sack. Just to give us a little bit more breathing room. But I really don't see that happening anytime soon. Jeez. All right, I'm giving up on blitzing, and then you smash it. Uh, I mean, we've been in much worse situations. But, you know, that being said, I still would like to be in a better position. Good hit, Anthony Richardson. Guess pass. It's mean outside pass. Or not. All right, stick in this cover three. Gotta make sure I'm in a position. Like, we're not going to be able to stop Patrick Mahomes. Just that, I mean, that throw is just next to impossible to defend. All right, we do have goal line defense in here. We've been, we're actually not that bad as far as goal line goes. Okay. Maybe we actually are a lot worse than I remember.
All right, so we got 49 seconds. That's not really enough time to score a touchdown. I just don't think it'll take enough time. I mean, that's really only... We still do have three timeouts, but even then, that's very, very few passes to get all the way down the field. But we've been in. I've done it before. I don't know if we'll be able to do it again. Well, Jeff Driscoll going open will help. Oh, dude, catch the ball. Is that cover two? I think I missed the outside. Yeah, I missed the outside streak in uh, DTR. Good route there by Etling. Call a timeout. Down to the 48 now. Let's go for Y Shallow Cross. See if Etling can get open again. He does. Good catch and fall. Second time out ball on the 34 now. Or the 31. We'll go middle high low yet again. Press coverage. Malik Cunningham looks like a touchdown. If he can beat his man off the line. I don't know if he did. Ah, I think that was still the right throw though. Just not proper execution I don't think. So it was press man. Like he's got it again. I don't know if it's going to be open again. Well, we do have Danny Etling. Jeez, I'm, even if even when Ryan Tannehill comes back, I think I'm gonna keep starting Danny Etling. All right, let's put Cunningham on a slant. Uh, I should have possession caught that. I don't know why I didn't. All right, let's go drive wide corner. Ah, uh, looks like it's zone, so I don't like what I was originally going to call. I got Etling on the zig. Oh, what a... Oh, it was Driscoll. Whoever it was, that was a fantastic route. I mean, you do get the touchdown before halftime. That was a really good play. Smart audible by me. Because I was going to try to throw it... Like to the left on Ritter with an out route. I think they, I think they would have had a zone right there. Eh. They might have. All right, extra point is up and good. 14 seconds left. Tried to not concede. Which you know is an actual task for us because we like to give up kick return touchdowns. Like it's Oprah giving away money. Yeah, it's a good bouncer. No, no. There we go, guys. There we go. All right, 10 seconds left. I'm going prevent defense. Man up three deep. Trust no one. All right. Now they're in Hail Mary range. All right. Going to Anthony Richardson, have to cheat a whole lot anytime it's a Hail Mary situation. All right, hey, they're going to, why'd they go save clock? He didn't even get out of bounds in time. You have Patrick Mahomes. Why are you not just bombing it in the first place? All right, offensive game plan. We're going to go run inside because I don't want to mess with the passing game and stop their inside run. Because... I don't like messing with the passing stuff. Ooh, Ritter can return this kick. I really thought that we had two excellent blocks on the edge and I was going to be able to score that for a couple of seconds. I mean, it was a very brief sec couple of seconds of hope, but... There was a little bit of hope. All right, good completion for Bryce Young there. Let's get in the single back. We haven't used 
haven't called a play in the single back all game. Um, I did not mean to call this. We'll go tight end drive. Felipe Franks. Six yards. Not bad, not bad at all. Alright, we'll try verticals. Pretty uh, standard single back play. Oh, I threw it the wrong person. X was wide open. X was wide open. Wow, that was almost disastrous. You know, I'm putting Etling on a streak. Good throw and completion there to Malik Cunningham. I right, will go Sluggo Seam. I tried to tell Fields to go out on his little route, but didn't work. All right, we'll try a big PA double move on the outside. See if it works. Does not. Ooh, but Etling is there. Did he roll for? Did get the first. Wow. Did not think he actually got there. All right, now we'll go basic four verts. Throw Justin Fields. Yeah, he's not catching that one. But we didn't lose yards, so I consider that a positive play. Because I did not think... I didn't see anyone else open. All right, drive wheel. I like Malik Cunningham on this route a lot. All right, good completion of DTR. Let's try a QB draw with Old Man Rogers. Never mind, they are blitzing. Let's go drive wide corner. I'm going to put Cunningham on a slant, which is my safety throw. That was scary. All right, we'll try Trey open. We'll go to dagger deep curl. If Driscoll can just find a pocket. If Driscoll can just find a pocket, we'll get a touchdown. I didn't, didn't even have time to complete my sentence. All right, another good drive by the offense there. And it puts us up a touchdown with... Oh, Dres no, Driscoll just got hurt. Ah, oh, boy. That's really sad. Because he has two touchdowns today. And a pretty good chunk of yards. All right, good stop by the team there. All right, they are coming out in a pretty heavy formation, considering Doug Peterson's playbook. I didn't even know Doug Peterson's playbook had anything other than shotgun and sink. Ooh! Ooh, that was a good move by Kenneth Walker. Elbow sprain will return soon, good. We cannot afford to not have Jeff Driscoll. I mean, Felipe Franks is good, but after Felipe Franks, Sam Ellinger is not that good. All right, good job there by Malik Willis. I'll go cover four palms. Ooh! Ah. Ooh! What a hit, Trey Lance. Really rocked him. All right, we got, trying a little bit of a risky blitz here. I think it's a run. Oh, uh, it, it was just silly me with a run, run the middle game plan plus the blitz. I assumed we would be able to combat that run. Got this guy. Ooh, ah, out of bounds. Good defense, though. Third and three. All right, let's try over Storm Brave. Gonna bring the heat. Add a baby. Let's go, defense. And they're gonna kick a field goal here. Well, we're going safe, man, in case they fake it.
Don't miss it, Graham. Don't miss it. Didn't miss it. All right. So now we, we, if we can't kick a field goal if we have to. If we get close enough. All right, let's go return. See if we can get something going. I doubt it, but you never know. All right, Ritter's on the return. Can we get a block from that guy? Nope. Ooh, good juke, good juke. Can't break away. Still got the ball at the 30-yard line. Pretty impressive. Let's try four verts. Just dump it off to Justin Fields. Take a couple yards. And that is the end of the third quarter heading into the fourth. I th we score a touchdown here. We do pretty much seal the game. Field goal will put us in a better position than we currently are in, but still would not be enough. So I obviously want a touchdown. Bro, Felipe Franks is like stuck on one of our linemen. Like it was literally a perfect opportunity for him right there. Right, I do like DTR, and if not, I check it down to Cunningham. All right, check it down to Cunningham. Ooh, broke away from his man a little bit there. Um, let's try shallow cross. Got DTR coming across from the right to left. Oh, I thought that was a corner route, not a curl. See, and that's why I don't call plays. I don't know exactly what they do. Ah, see, every time we do something good, I just mess it up. Like, oh, all we have to do is score a touchdown and we win the game. Okay, let's throw an interception and give them the ball back at the halfway line. I almost want them to run it so they wind the clock down. Good tackle, good tackle. What's the flag? Holding? Ooh, offensive holding. Uh, yeah, we got to accept. Ah, you know, it's always tough. You know, turning down a negative play with this team. Because they could just get it back and more. Jeez, guys. Do we, I seriously, do we have to stay in the nickel so we have an extra beefy boy out there? Like, this is a... I mean, that was bad. Like, we normally do give up a big play every once in a while, but not usually in that situation. I would love a Marcus Mariota interception. All right, well, we at least tackled him. I really thought it was going to be play action. Good hit McSorley, and their center just got hurt. And we got to take the uh, victories where we can. I'm going to blitz with Mariota. Just kidding. Ooh. Oh, Tyrod almost got the pick. Third and goal. Third and goal. All right, we'll try... No, uh, too high. Nice little nickel blitz. I have to cheat over this side a little bit to watch this number two. Oh, I'm out of my zone. Seriously, guys. Like, come on.
Gotta do a little bit better there. Like you ha like he wasn't even that open. There was a guy right behind him. That was Trey Lance, our best safety. All right, it's a field goal game. Three minutes left. Aaron Rodgers gonna take us down the field. Or a Desmond Ritter kick return would be even better. You know what, he didn't fumble it, that was a good return. All right, Aaron. I'm making a coaching change. Go to the depth chart. Game's on the line. We need Malik Cunningham in the slant in the slot. I'm sorry, Etling, you've served your purpose. But we need the run after catch. Oh, they have so much momentum. Oh, jeez, guys. Great blocking. Just superb blocking. The baby Malik. See, that's why we put him in here. We're going to need those, like, extra five, six yards run after catch. We've got DTR on the check down. Nine yard gain. Take us to the two minute warning. Alright, stay in verticals. Good throw to Driscoll. To the 30 yard line. Not going to call a timeout. I mean, I don't think we're going to need to call any timeouts. That was nearly intercepted. I could have thrown Driscoll, but that was a little bit riskier of a throw. Oh, could not come down with it. Because Brian Burns was in coverage. Is Brian Burns really that good in coverage? Oh, this is man. This is press man. DTR, I'm looking at you, baby. Nope, we're going Driscoll. Oh no, fourth and five. Fourth and five. Can we hit this field goal? I really don't feel that confident. Can we? Oh, we can. Okay. And Felipe Franks is hurt, so we're down. You know, Driscoll is back that drive, so we're down to one tight end. Oh, I really do not like the position I just put us in. Because that is a decent amount of time for Mahomes. Good tackle, Mark. Ooh, oh, you're kidding me, guys. Where are the rest of you? Yeah, they're going... They're going all out. Okay, there's no point in a booth review. Okay, they moved it back one yard and added one second back. Ooh, that's going to make such a big difference. All right, guess pass. I'm going to blitz with Richardson if there's an opening. All right. Good chunk of yards they just got. Bring an extra blitz on this side. Out of bounds at the 48, 37. Seconds left. It's getting really close. We might lose our first game here. I really think we're about to lose. All right, throws it away. Four, wait, why is it fourth and 31? Wait, what just happened? Did a Madden glitch just... Did I get a favorable Madden glitch? I have no clue what just happened. But I'm not going to complain. Because 
So, you know, I'll take the extra plot armor. Like, what actually happened? Like, I straight up have no clue what took place. Can you believe cutting him out? Oh, no. Yeah. Um, and we're going to overtime. Unless somehow we get so wide open. Um, don't tackle him. Do not tackle him. Why are we tackling him? There's, we left too much time on the clock. How we, don't tackle him. Take time off the clock. And we just lost. Going on, Trey Lance. Need to block it here. Need to block it. Oh! Pitch it, pitch it, pitch it. Oh! We will take it, though. Oh, if McSorley could just pitch that real quick. Get a, get a blocked kick for a touchdown to win the game. That would have been amazing. We'll go tails. We won the toss. And we will receive. And Aaron Rodgers is going to get us our second overtime win in a row. Bro, why is this cutscene so long? Don't give us that long to watch if we don't get that long to choose. All right, boys, we just need a touchdown here. All we need is a touchdown. Touchdown, we keep the undefeated season alive. Could they call a cover two one of these times? Justin Fields. Dude. Catch the ball. Like it wasn't even contested. Oh, third and ten already. Trying a little bit of trickery here. Just need to move their defense around a little bit. Bro, Fields was interfered with so much. Like, they were pretty much tackling him. I mean, we're trying it again, because I think Driscoll got open. But they were all over fields right there. All right, we're calling the same play. Because it is working. Gotta, gotta stop throwing Justin Fields. Gotta stop looking in his direction at all. He cannot catch. He is a runner. Why is Brian Burns in man coverage again? Just give up. He, you're not gonna be able to stop with Brian Burns. It's like a, an elite pass rusher being wasted in oh Cunningham that's a touchdown oh I stepped out of bounds oh that would have been such a good touchdown going fast yet again there's Driscoll just past Burns take him out of coverage Jags he can't do it and we got a Ritter angle route to end the game do not doubt Aaron Rodgers. He is him. Two weeks back-to-back -back game-winning overtime touchdowns. It's just so good. I mean, Desmond Ritter, backup running back, catching the game-winning touchdown. I mean, you can't really, you can't write a script better than that. I mean, negative one rushing yards is uh, pretty rough, but 423 passing yards, 
not too shabby. I mean, we got every all quarterbacks played pretty well today. Yeah, let's not talk about the running. Driscoll, main target, 10 catches, 160 yards, and two touchdowns. Etling played well. I mean, really got most people involved. Defensively, Malik Willis, ten, he had 10 tackles? I did, wow. No sacks. Trace McSorley with the lone interception. Perfect kicking the ball wise. Nothing great on the return front. But we somehow squeak by with yet another win. Thanks to a Madden glitch and Madden letting us block a field goal. So I think I've run out of excuses and complaints for the next couple of episodes about the game. I mean, it's kind of a makeup for how bad things were last episode. I mean, the game was lagging and I'm playing offline on a PlayStation 5. But next episode, the 4-5 and five Buccaneers, a very good defense. Fred Warner in the middle is a little scary, but I feel like we'll be able to do just fine. But I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see more videos and clips. And I'll see you all for a game against the Buccaneers.